Hello and welcome to the video nap and Twitter tips that challenge of four, day three of Glorious Goodwood and day four of Glorious Galway. Um, we'll start off with the video nap. The video nap, it was a toss up between Yarrow and High Shields. I went for Yarrow. Um, as you've seen, I've, I've written already, you know, her run last time out, massive price, but she, she ran a stormer. I like the way, there's lots to like, I like the way she stayed on late, I like the way she'd been out of sorts, I mean obviously she pulled up in last year's Queen's Vars and it looked as though she might have even been like retired there, but they kept doing training, so obviously she, she must be showing something at home, her, her run at Pontefract last time out was definitely in the right direction, after two pretty poor efforts beforehand, between then and that Ascot race. Um, I like the way she was staying on, it's suggesting that one mile six is no problem to that for the first race. Um, I like her breeding, suggests she'll stay. How old she is, some Michael Stout type, and you know that he'll always get improvement out of types as they get older. And I think she's got an excellent chance in this. I think, you know, Pomona's got a good chance, but she's got to prove she can do it again. And I like Mill Springs as well, and I love John Gosden as a trainer, as you and if you follow me on Twitter, but I think. I think Yarrow is definitely the one to beat for me, and she is the video nap. Um, over in Galway, I was mentioned as well. I've mentioned it in the Galway place. I love Pyromania. I think he's got a brilliant chance. He's, he's got lots in his favour. It looks like he's been laid out for it. We know Tony Martin trains him for this race, and he's you know, won it last twice with sort of similar profile types. And I think Pyromania has an excellent chance. Uh, all things Twitter Tips Challenge now. Um, day two saw. It be a battle in the end between myself, KJ and Dana, but it was KJ who just well, I say just knows me out. He napped Ulysses. If he hadn't have napped Ulysses, I would have won, but hey ho. That is power up nap and next best in a Twitter Twitter tips the challenge just shows. If you nap the right one, you've got a smashing chance of winning and KJ has shown that. KJ is into Sunday's Galway final along with myself, who is my blog, and uh, Kingram, who was Tuesday's winner. Hoping to be Thursday's winner, you've got obviously myself, you've got Ben Homans, Jason Heffron, Adam Adam Crooks, loads of Adams playing, got Adam Webb, Adam Perkins on, on Friday, got Adam Crooks who won the Royal Ascot on his first Royal Ascot Twitter tip challenge on his first Twitter tip challenge outing, so he's definitely one to uh, watch. And we have a new player, I only know him by Rye, I don't know your surname, but your Twitter handle will be underneath there so yes you can find him on Twitter through that if you don't follow him already um, so yeah um, their selections will be underneath plenty of good racing to get through today the Goodwill Cup looks and maybe not a, a vintage renewal but an interesting one so yeah plenty of good racing to enjoy best of luck with whatever you're backing and goodbye